enlisted in that movement. Or if you're doing the water, Sujalam, who is good water. Unfortunately, we don't have good water here, whether it's Yamuna or the Ganga. So many times I'm told that we should start singing Sujalam, bad water, so that it at least rises the consciousness of people that we should not litter these beautiful rivers. But once upon a time, the Ganga and the Yamuna had absolutely sparkling water which you could drink. So when you show the water, the line only says Sujara, lovely water. Now what you do with the water, talk of the waves, you talk of the little rivulet, you talk of the lake, you talk of the large river, you talk of your water where everybody plays, you talk of water where you wash the face, you talk of water which quenches thirst. Now this is all in the imagination of the dancer. She recreates the story around the lyric. The lyric doesn't say that they played in the water, that there, there, is, uh, there are so many different kinds of uh, river bodies. That the lyric doesn't say. But this is how in the interpretation, as I said, her element, poetry music dance, the dancer takes liberty. She goes beyond the lyric. So that's very important to know in the dance. It's not an action song. Otherwise, it's just an action song. The lyric is there, and you interpret it with your hands. How is it different from Abhinaya or dance? This is the difference. It's a stylized vocabulary. You say to a move, the entire body reacts. When you bring down the moonlight, it can be this. It can be the water. It can be the reflection of the moon in the water. It can be the lily just responding to the moonlight. It can be lots of things. So that working <coughs> of elaborating poetry is in the hands of the dancer. And it's like clay. Every time she does it, it's fresh, it's new. If you do the same Mande Matram again, it's not going to be the same. It's not going to be the same the way you sang it. It's not going to be the same how you dance it. Because I haven't heard anybody say that we've heard the Bhimse Joshi's any rag, Dindola, for example, or Malpons. We don't say I've heard him sing Malpons. Every time he sings Malpons, मेरा भाई की पद पदाभियां जो बहुत सुंदर होती हैं और उनमें कृष्ण के प्रति उनका जो उन्माद है उसको बहुत सुंदर तरीके से दर्शाया जाता है तो मैं ज़्यादा कुछ इस कंपोजिशन के बारे में बोलूँगी नहीं क्योंकि ये आप सब की How many people are here in the south? Just one. So I'm not going to explain it for your sake. I hope you know Hindi. So this is a very simple piece, Mani Chakar Rakhuji. Please keep me as your servant. Because the servant is one who is always close to the master. So Meera says, don't please keep me as your slave. Mujhe chakar ban ke, no kar chakar nahi hota hai. Vaisa chakar ban ke mujhe rakhi je, taaki mein hamesha aapke paas hai. Thank you.
all, when we actually split on Mother Earth, do you ever think that it can hurt somebody, somebody's sensitivity? It's going to pain somebody? No, we don't want to think. We think it's our right. What we want on this Mother Earth? But in dance, it's not like that. The first class makes you extremely sensitive to your own environment. You ask for forgiveness and you actually ask permission from Mother God. Can I stamp on you? I'm going to stamp it on you ruthlessly in the next two to three hours. Please forgive me. So this is the first gesture that we do before a class, before the program, before starting anything and when we end the class, when we end the program, again to say thank you for allowing me to do this. So from the first day of the class itself, it is kind of registered that dance is not a body-body movement. Unlike any other dance forms which you see in the West, it's basically investing on just the body. The body has a being to communicate, but here it's the body, the mind, the rasa, everything combined, head to toe, we communicate. So it's a very, very complex form of expression, extremely sophisticated, extremely evolved. Because when we go out and perform, they say, how do you move your face like this? How do you move your hands like this? Well, it's a comprehensive thing, you know, everything goes simultaneously. So the training process is also extremely scientific. We first prepare the body. One of the exercises, one first exercise.
this is a difficult adult because many times when the youngsters do it, when you jump, the tendency of the body is to go.